Right. So there's Demi Live. Round no, of our weekend. Don't, don't reveal that. <laughs> but this is cute. proper live. This is but actually live. This is okay though, because this bit nobody actually watches. Oh, true, true. Wait, what? When do they start watching? Hi everyone. <laughs> <laughs> it's a slight experiment, as you might be able to tell. We're live broadcasting to uh, Facebook and YouTube. A uh, little bit of a trial run, and Rob and I love experimenting. So it's true. Cool. It's true. <laughs> You don't want to know half the stuff we get up to, jeez. So here we are in the Plains TV cabin <laughs> at, uh, at the end of Sunday at IWM Duxford. Meet the Fighters Air Show. Well, we've had a really good weekend <laughs> in the end. Yeah, it has been. Uh, considering yesterday it was chucking it down, uh, today has been the complete most glorious things we've ever seen in the existence. I just, uh, I just had a little mess up. I'm tr- I, oh, I, don't, I, don't no, I like that. I don't normally sit in this seat. This is Rob's seat. Um, this so is I'm just playing back Rob. It's a, it's it's of me looking sultry, and uh, and let's face it, handsome. So I'm all right with this. This is what I was supposed to play. This is a grey Saturday runway. Never got off the ground yesterday, unfortunately. Much like lots of other aeroplanes, for very good reason. Actually, nil visibility a lot of the well, not nil, but you know what I mean. Uh, and raining. Poor old David and Adrian. ah, they were fine. They were all right. Yeah, they were, no problems from them at all. I was no uh, complaining. Or I was staying very busy inside the trailer. Uh, next one is uh, yeah, Q Sunday morning and it was glorious sunshine. And myself and Lee couldn't resist but go and shoot some nice stuff of the aeroplanes out with the dew in the grass and it's been pretty much like that all day, isn't it? Yeah, it has been probably one of the best days at an airshow we've had this year. Um, in terms of weather, you know, just pure awesome weather and I wish that I could have actually been outside in it instead of sat inside in a trailer vision mixing yeah quite right mm-hmm. God, it's hard work as well this vision mixing i'm struggling over here we're trying to give you a bit of a yeah it's a quick rundown of of the air show weekend this being one of the real well the real highlight if you like so this is uh the spitfires so we have 14 spitfires in formation there's one one flying over us now as we record this I'm slightly scared <laughs> that was I really the audio strange on. wasn't it <laughs> um uh, again, much like September, but 14 and oh, I don't know the conditions were nice or something. It just felt really, really good today. A um, couple more clips of yeah, just the action. It's a really hard to portray on video, but uh, yeah, we had some nice B17 taxi under at one point, and then flying over the top of it, and it looked quite, as they say. I'll bring up a bit of the audio and play a bit more of that again. Let's play. There we go. Give you a bit of audio to listen to. No, this is probably getting incredibly dull, but in this time we're noise rather than us jabbering. And then to round off the day, I'm just going to show you a quick um, red arrow. We had what I think was the final red arrows display of the season. And it was damn good too. We mm-hmm. see them a lot, and uh, the conditions are better at some shows. Absolutely, yeah. <laughs> it's insane. It was insane today. Get a full display, I suppose we did. We had. We did like get a full display. Yeah, we'll, we'll leave you with this um, DVD and Blu-ray of the show are available from planestv.com. We'll pop a link of this Facebook video and this YouTube video, if both have worked, and um, they which they will have done. Experts. And we had lovely onboard material with the Spitfires, I should say, and also the Great War Team. Leave the vampires. The as vampires, well. yeah. The vampire stuff looks really cool. We put so a nice yeah. display together with the Mig Fifteen. That was awesome. So we're going to leave you with the Red Arrows display just for a couple of minutes. And as I say, we, they did manage the heart. And watch out for the engagement, a live engagement at the air show. Here's me and Ian. <laughs> dear, oh dear. <laughs> we, we did it over the intercom. Right, I've set up a macro to shut up, Rob. <laughs> yeah, I'll put the Red Arrows on. Bye, Rob. Bye, bye. Bye. So the smoke is on to the right. Ready for... Red, white and blue, come on Duxford, let's have a huge round of applause for Great Britain!
pulling up at 500 miles an hour and five. Six thousand feet above the Cambridge skies, the white smoke comes on. Synchro getting ready to draw their famous heart. Keep your eyes to the top right of the heart. Here comes Red Knight. He's going to draw a spear through the heart. And now I'd like to take this opportunity to be the first to congratulate Daxi and Tash on their engagements. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. On one knee in front of the commentary box, we have a proposal happening right now. She had no idea that was happening. Tash is the daughter of a retired group captain, Ian Dick, a former Red One. And there we go, ladies and gentlemen. I think she said yes. Is that a nod? Yes, it is, everybody. Fantastic. Congratulations, guys. Camera's ready for the amazing Jippo Pass. Oh, and now, Duxford, please put your hands together for the Synchro Pair. You've been watching the Royal Air Force aerobatic team, the Red Arrows!